Hello everyone. Hello mm. everyone. My name is Arav and this is my sister Ava. She's going to be helping me. So today we are going to try a lemon float. So for this experiment you need a peeled lemon. And you also need a unpeeled lemon. You also need a knife. And also, and also a peeler. Also, two glasses of water. So, first you put, I mean, first, yeah, yeah. So, Let's see my sister is. Ava is going to put this lemon in the water. And see what happens? This lemon sit. Now, let's put this lemon and see what happens. You might think it sits. So, then you might just try it out. And you might say, what? It floated. So why is that? So you might wonder, why is that? Because this lemon, this lemon is, this lemon is heavier than this lemon. So this lemon sank, but this lemon did it. That's like the heavier stuff floated and the lighter stuff sank. So you might wonder, why is that? That's because this, the, the, Unpeeled lemon has tiny air bubbles in it. I mean, like thousands of them that help it float. But this lemon doesn't have any. That's why it just sinks. So now, have you ever wondered how a lemon tastes? Shower! No, no, no. You, you, you may not think that. It doesn't, it doesn't taste, taste sour before you try. It doesn't. Because there's no thing as that. Now, now taste it and see. Sour. Sour. So, the reason why it tastes sour is there's this there's this acid called and uh, there's this citric acid that 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 makes the lemon sour. That's why it tastes sour. So, that's the end of the experiment, everyone. Bye! Good day! Good day!